So our Grand Challenge project is to try to present fully annotated tumors where we know everything about every cell in the cancer in a three-dimensional virtual reality environment so that everyone from scientists to patients and students can understand cancer in a new way. We actually have something in our virtual reality environment called Superman mode, which literally lets you fly inside a tumor, point at every cell, know exactly what kind of cell it is, know what it's doing, know who it's talking to, and know what it's saying to them. For me, it sounded like uh, science fiction because it's giving a step forward in cancer research. Uh, like, try to uh, study each single cell within the tumor without disrupting its structure. And I think that it's very exciting. It's an enormous challenge. You know, I, I sort of liken it you know, to the idea of putting a man on Mars. Right? There's nothing that violates the laws of physics, but there's so much technology that you have to develop to do it. I think this is the very cutting edge of how people will, in the future, understand not only cancer, but organismal development. All sorts of biological problems all happen in 3D. And they happen in 3D with cells communicating with each other um, in ways that we really don't yet capture with any technology that we, that, that we have developed so far. I think what this will do is to bring into Cambridge the seed that will be the future of biology.